To start all the exercises, I recommend the mild stretch of the Achilles tendon. For range of motion, you could start by doing windshield wiper movement to keep the ankle from getting too stiff. Angle isometric is the most conservative strengthening exercise. This is ankle eversion isometric. I'm exaggerating the movement, and isometric will minimize any movement. This is ankle inversion isometric. Besides using a balloon, you can also use any type of cushion. Seated toe raises is a good way to maintain dorsiflexor strength and range of motion. Resistive plantar flexion with resistance band is a good way to activate your plantar flexors. Seated heel raises is a good way to maintain Achilles tendon strength and plantar flexion range of motion. The progression for seated heel raise assists the standing heel raise in standing. And the progression for seated toe raise is assisted toe raise and standing. After assisted heel raise is heel raise without assistance. The same for toe raises. To progress ankle eversion strength, we can add resistance using resistance band. And we can do resisted ankle inversion to progress ankle inversion strength. Resisted ankle inversion in figure 4 position is an alternative position for resisted ankle inversion. If you made it to the end of the video, thank you so much for watching. Next week, we're going to talk about balance exercises to prevent future ankle sprains after an existing ankle injury. I hope you look forward to it.